Hey, Tony here. So recently I did a live stream with a great group of people over at Fans of Something um, where we showcased our top five Lionsgate still books. So today I wanted to take time to actually do a collection video of all of the Lionsgate still books that I have in my collection, which is just a little over 100. And what I thought I would do is just showcase all of these so that you can be aware of some of the releases that are um, that were out there. You know, a lot of these are already out of print and unavailable, but I would like to kind of show what I've got in the collection. I'm going to do this in alphabetical order for the most part, but I am going to try to start it off with some um, older Lionsgate titles that have been out for a long time. Um, but everything in the, everything in all the little groups are going to be in alphabetical order, so maybe that will help um, in the long run as far as if you're looking for any of these particular still books. And I'm going to do this as quickly as possible. I'm not going to discuss the films. I'm just kind of showcasing what the still book looks like. Um, some of these are still sealed up. Some of these are open, but they're all in plastic wrap for the most part so i'm not going to take them out of the wrapping either i'm just going to show you the cover so first up we have apocalypse now we have first blood hero highlander kill bill kill bill volume 2 pulp fiction sin city stargate terminator 2 judgment day and total recall and then the next batch that I'm going to show you um, was, I believe I got these at Target. They were Mondo Steel books. We got one for Highlander and also one for Reservoir Dogs. And then we have um, the Saw 8 Film Collection Steel book and also a Best Buy exclusive Jigsaw Steel book. And a Leprechaun 7 Film Collection still book. And we got an FYE exclusive Halloween still book. Okay, next up we have American Assassins, Divergent, Insurgent, and Allegiant. Then we have The Expendables, The Expendables 2, and The Expendables 3, Gods of Egypt 3D. Hellboy, Hunter Killer, Ken, La La Land, Now You See Me, Now You Don't, number one, Now You See Me, number two, Robin Hood, Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. Okay, now I'm going to show you my John Wick still books. We have John Wick, John Wick Chapter 2, John Wick 2 Film Collection. John Wick 3 Parabellum, John Wick 3 Parabellum, John Wick 3 Parabellum, and we also got the little mini John Wick 3 Parabellum still book, and we have John Wick um, chapters 1 through 3, and lastly we have the John Wick 3 film collection box set, which is a really nice set. Okay, another great set is the Rambo still book collection. So really like these. And also we got an individual release for Rambo Last Blood. And then for the Hunger Games, we got the UK still book for Hunger Games, Catching Fire, Mockingjay Part 1, Mockingjay Part 2. Then we got this really nice box set with the four still books and a different box set with four different still books. Okay, and here's some of the Target exclusives. We have 31, Deepwater Horizon, Dirty Dancing, Hacksaw Ridge, Hellboy, Power Rangers, the Rob Zombie Collection, Arnold Schwarzenegger Collection, with this really nice lenticular, Sicario, Twilight Collection, and wonder. Okay, now I'm going to show you the Best Buy exclusives that have been out for the past few years with the really nice looking slips. We have Three from Hell, 310 to Yuma, American Psycho, Angel Heart, Apocalypse Now, Belly, Cabin in the Woods, Chaos Walking, Clerks 3, 
Dirty Dancing, Dread, Evil Dead 1 and Evil Dead 2, Ghost in the Shell, Hacksaw Ridge, Halloween 1978, Hell or High Water, Highlander, The Hitman's Bodyguard, Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard, The Hurt Locker, Kick-Ass, Knives Out, La La Land, The Limey, Midway, Midway, the Target Exclusive, Moonfall, The Punisher, Punisher Warzone, Ron, Requiem for a Dream, Reservoir Dogs, Saul, Spiral, Sicario, Terminator 2, Judgment Day, Total Recall, The Unbearable Weight of Massive Talent, Universal Soldier, Warm Bodies, and The Warrior. I do have a majority of these already unwrapped, so definitely search out my channel if you'd like to see a closer look at each of these. So those are all of the Lionsgate steelbooks that I have in my collection. Now, I may be missing some, but I really do think that I have probably a majority of the U.S. releases. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know if you know of any of these that I might be missing. And also, let me know which of these are your favorite, because I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you had subscribed. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.